Hi guys, before we get to the installation, let's talk about acceptable tools. With sealed solder connectors, you won't need one of these crimping tools, but you will need either a hot air gun or a butane torch. Now let's get to the installation. The solder only connector has a preflux solder sleeve in the middle of the connector. Make sure you follow the instructions on your packaging for the proper wire strip lengths. For butt connectors, you'll want to intermingle the wires for the best solder joint. Place the connector over the intermingled wire so that the solder sleeve is directly over the stripped wires before heating. When recovering the tubing, start by focusing the heat at the middle of the connector and move the heat to one end. You want to make sure any air under the tubing is forced out. Repeat on the other side. Again, make sure that the end of the tubing is fully recovered down to the wire's insulation. After both sides are completely recovered, move the heat to the middle of the connector where the solder sleeve is. If possible, rotate the connector to evenly distribute the heat. Wait for the solder sleeve to become liquidous. It will flow into the wire strands. Now you can remove it from the heat and let it cool for a few minutes. Now you have a termination that will last as long as your wire. For solder only rings, spades and quick disconnects, you simply place your stripped wire into the open end of the connector and through the solder sleeve. When recovering the tubing, start by focusing the heat at the middle of the connector and heat the unrecovered tubing back towards your wire's insulation. Move the heat back to the middle of the connector where the solder sleeve is. If possible, rotate the connector to evenly distribute the heat. Wait for the solder sleeve to become liquidous. You can now remove it from the heat and let it cool for a few minutes. It is okay if some of the solder escapes the top of the terminal. Simply tap it away and reseal the neck of the tubing while the tubing is still warm.